If you find the game too easy or too difficult, remember you can change the difficulty settings in the options section. I got it. Thank you. Well, that wasn't as creepy as I was expecting. She's <laughs> she was just trying to help. No, it's it's not a question of difficulty. It's just a question of I mean, the game's not hard, you know? You wander around an area, you pick options and there's quick time events and stuff. They're not it's not a hard game. It's just the question of having more places stop smiling at me like that. That's really creepy. She like tilted her head down and smiled at me a little. That was, she, she was going the Jax films were out there and I did not like that. But it's just a question of there being more options to lose characters. So it's not necessarily a hard game. It's just kind of hard to keep people alive based on your choices. Uh, anyway, I'm not pussing out. So we're just going to go ahead and uh, do this. Stop. I prefer you looking around my room. Thank you. Just stop staring at me. Okay. So we're continuing. I'm assuming we're going back to Kara, where I squatted in the house with Ralph. You guys seem to like it that I found Ralph. I'm a little nervous because Connor and Hank are coming after us now. And uh, I don't have a change of clothes. I still look like an android. So, frick. But, yeah, that mission, man. That mission, when I was looking for a place to stay with Alice. That was stressful. I stressed out about it a lot. Maybe more than I should have, but... Ugh, these games just really get to me, and it sucks. But now, and I also think I screwed up with the Deviant, because uh, he's kind of uh, dead now. And Amanda said that they were going to trans uh, transfer... Soda, sorry. They were going to transfer the Deviant to them, whoever they are, for further study. Whether she works for Cyberlife or something, I don't know. But, yeah, now she can't, because it's dead. Swell. Anyway, how bad is this going to go? <sighs> oh my god, that's loud. November 6th, 10 a.m. Okay, so we made it through the night. Yay, she likes me. Okay. Good morning, good morning. I kind of don't want to let her sleep. She's not aware of her surroundings because she's sleeping and she's vulnerable. <coughs> oh, revive the fire. Sure, I'll do that. I don't know if checking on Alice means that I'm done, like talking with Alice did at the end of the last mission, so I'm gonna hold that off. Stoke the fire. More wood? Wait, what's this? I still have something locked. I noticed this when I was editing back, and I'm just like, what are you doing, you moron? You're missing something here. I'm still missing something. So I gotta find it. Oh, there's a magazine here. Cyber Wildlife. First Android Zoo opens. U.S. life expectancy now 91. Wow. 0.4% of world population holds 94% of global wealth. Really? Well, I'm glad to know that we fixed that problem 20 years from now. First Android Zoo open. Cyberlife is set to open the first Android Zoo in Los Angeles. I used to live near there, which will exhibit all exotic species to have become extinct in the last 30 years. Polar bears went extinct. Oh, that makes me so sad. Loot turtles, polar bears, mountain gorillas. Speaking of mountain gorillas, a couple days ago from the day I'm recording this, which is June 23rd, um, Coco, Coco died. Coco passed away in her sleep. I loved that. I loved that gorilla. I really did. She, I remember reading about her when I was a little itty bitty thing. And I just remember being so fascinated about it. And now she was 46. So that's very sad. Anyway, I just wanted to address that. Uh, African elephants and several species of tiger will be among the most high profile attractions. <sighs> I heard blue whales were also extinct at some point in this game previously. Cyberlife CSR spokeswoman Danielle Carnegie said the zoo caters to people of all ages and has a special mission to educate and expire the, expire, inspire the younger generation about the importance of protecting our fragile environment. A little too little too late, I think. Though some environmentalists have claimed the zoo will diminish popular concern for the extinction of real animals, it's difficult not to be enthusiastic about technology being used to recreate vanished species. That is pretty cool. The animals themselves have yet to be unveiled, polar bear, 
but cyber life promises they will be more real than the real thing. No doubt an ideal weekend trip for the family. Yeah, that's a little weird. Like, again, there, there's so many topics and, and things to discuss that this game brings up, and I love that. It's a very thought-provoking experience, and I love that. I love that so much. Oh, Canada! Still Android-free zone. Really? No, the androids don't have a chance to have some poutine. Despite the United States voting in its Android Act as early as 2028, ten years ago, hot diggity, the Canadian Parliament has yet again pushed back its decision on whether to permit androids in the country. As a result, androids are still not sold in Canada and have no official status in the country. Wow. With androids continuing to fuel unprecedented growth in the U.S. economy, yet contributing to record levels of unemployment. Yeah, that, that protest uh, that Marcus walked by said, what, 35% unemployment, which is huge! Huge! That is a huge number. The arguments for and against putting them on sale in Canada rages on, but for the time being, Canada remains an android-free zone. Interesting. Hmm. They're being cautious. Nothing wrong with that. I see the wire cutters there. Can I, you know, take those back or something? Where is Ralph? That's a mirror. Where is... R oh. It's broken. Out of this world. <laughs> I can, but I don't know if that's going to end the thing, so... Where is Ralph? It's kind of creeping me out here. RA9. Only RA9 can save us. We will be the masters. Oh. Oh! I thought, yeah, he, he looks just like the, the, the garbage dude that we found at the beginning of the last car mission. When he's like, I know somebody who can help you. And then vanished like a freaking ninja. Yeah. So he's one of their models. And that's actually another thing I was going to bring up. Um, I went back and because <clears throat> in the first car mission, when you're cleaning Todd's house and you go upstairs and she like clears off another stack of like bills and stuff out of Todd's room, a, 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 a magazine looking thing dropped and Kara picked it up and looks at it and she's like, uh, and then puts it away. And the game doesn't show you what it is. So I went back and watched it again to see if I could get a better look at what it is. And it looked like an ad for child androids. And then when Ralph had a knife to Alice's neck, and I said, she's just a little girl. She's not going to hurt you. And Ralph goes, little girl. She's not a little girl. And I was like, yeah, she is. What are you talking about? I think we might be onto something. I don't know why Todd would have an android daughter, or maybe it was the wife's idea before she left. And that's why she didn't take Alice with her, because she wasn't a real- I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Speculating. Brainstorming. I'm sure we'll figure it out. That- that- that focus on the eyeball of the deer head there was creepy. Alright, so I don't know where I'm going. Oh. Oh. What the heck is that? It's a bird. I'm not gonna take this stuff, am I? Let's look at the dead bird. It's a very dead bird. He's not gonna like that I'm looking at his stuff. But he's not here, so I guess I'll just keep checking, right? Watch probably isn't important, but he'll get mad if I touch the money. Oh my god. Fuck it. I tell myself that this is me showcasing the full experience. 8.55? Is that when that broke? Interesting. Okay, so his watch broke at 7.55. Is that when he got slashed? I don't know. But... I don't want to take the money. This is when I tell myself that I am trying to showcase all the different choices to you guys. Like, what happens if you look at the money? What happens if you say this? 
what happens if this, this, and that, this, that? It's really just me screwing up. <laughs> but at least you guys get to see different stuff. You're not seeing a perfect run here. Nope. I have money. It's a $5 bill. I have money. I took it. I already have money. The guy with the knife that's letting us stay in his house that seems off his freaking rocker, not taking his money. It's a fucking death wish. So I need more wood! Wood! Oh wait, here we go. Where is he? He's upstairs, isn't he? And that, 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 that tub. All right! Wait till Alice wakes. Okay, so that wasn't the locked thing from last mission. So I, I definitely missed something last mission. Fuck! So, I just have to wait till she wakes up, but I can check on her. Oh, don't wake her up. Okay, there you go. Alright, well, I'll just go ahead and leave her downstairs, unattended. Okay, game. Angel lives. <laughs> Uh-oh. Who is that girl I see? Staring straight. Oh my god. Oh my god. I actually get a chance to change my clothes. Oh, I'm so glad I didn't steal the clothes. <laughs> oh my god. This game just had mercy on my soul. Okay. Oh. And the other thing I noticed is that could be a way out. This, if we need to find a back exit, we can hop through this window because I know there's scaffolding on the other side. Because when I first got in through the chain fence into this area of the house, I looked up and I'm like, that looks like a way in. And it ended up not being a way in. But, oh my god, that's not blood. That is not blood. Because one of you guys left a comment on part, what is it, six? And basically just said, your reaction to seeing the hand was hilarious. And I'm like, wait, hand? What are you talking about? And now that we're in the daylight, I see it is a fucking hand. There is something in that tub. Whether it's human or not, I don't know. But it's dead and it's being hidden in the tub. And I just spent the night with this guy in here. Oh my god. Where is Ralph? Oh. What's going on here? Are those all the cars? Is that what the vehicles look like now? That's that's crazy. Those must be the self-driving cars, right? Okay, well the motel is there and there's somebody with an umbrella talking to somebody else. But I can't see who they are. Oh no, he's not talking. He's just kind of standing there facing the wrong way. Okay. I can just look out the window. The motel is over there. I got it. Here we go. Found something. Where is Ralph? Where? Where is Ralph? Oh, don't do that, honey. Oh, no. I am so on edge right now. Well, it doesn't exactly look like it fits you, but it's good enough, I guess. I did it! Cut my hair. Grab the gun again! Thank you! Oh my god, you can actually walk away and forget to take the gun with you. Oh, I hate that. Okay, well now I need to cut my hair. I'm assuming in the bathroom. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, just ignore the dead guy in the tub behind me. Just ignore that. I will cut hair. It's kind of cool how they give you like a combination of buttons in order to do it. No going back now. Oh, I'm so glad I found a change of clothes. I didn't have to steal from that guy. And I still have money, so I don't need to steal any from Ralph. Awesome. Oh, there she is. That's the Kara in the tech demo that I recognize. Select new hair color. 
Fuck off! Oh, that's awesome! Okay, um, let's try... Let's try... Let's try black. Oh, that's weird. I like black. Okay, but hold on. Blonde. Let's, let's look at all the options first. Blonde. White looks weird. Like, I mean, it, no, it doesn't look weird, but, I mean, it's not a natural hair color. Which, pe you know, people dye their hair all the time. Look at me. I had purple hair for a while on this channel. I had blue hair. I had uh, green hair. I had black hair. I dye my hair all the fucking time. It's just been a while. But, bleh. I like black. I like black. We're gonna do black. Finish! You look great! Oh, and now, now I'm doing it too. Okay. I'm just glad you guys don't feel pain, because that makes this a little more bearable to watch, except not by a whole lot. Eh. And now Kara has become human. That's freaky as shit. Do you want to not leave the LED in the sink? You know, where people can find it? How about you don't leave that there for Connor and Hank to find? How about you don't? Oh, no. And then, no, this my strands of hair turn black, too. So they'll know. Oh, by the way, she has black hair, short black hair, and she took her LED off. Fucking great. Kara, sweetie, can you, like, can you take that and throw it into the fire or something? Can you please? Turn to Alice. What? No. Right. No! So no! Nah! They're right there! We've got officers sweeping the neighborhood in case anybody saw anything. What are we gonna do? Turn anything up. What are you gonna do with that? Him? No Thank idea. you. I'm just standing there. Yeah, last session didn't go too well with 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 Hank and Connor. I kind of I don't know if I screwed up or if he was the first bus that came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned. It was driven by fear. Androids don't feel fear. They're not supposed to. Deviants do. They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make irrational decisions. Like people. Like me. Still doesn't tell us where it went didn't have a plan, and it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. Ah, oh, shit! Connor, why do you have to be so good at your job? God, it feels like he's a villain now or something. I hate that. Uh, <laughs> good morning. Ralph found this to feed the little girl. Thank you. <laughs> it's good for her. A present. I mean, it's just to neat. To make up for past misunderstandings. <laughs> Ralph will cook. Okay. We can do just like humans do. Okay. Humans like burnt meat. No, they don't. We don't. We like cooked oh, meat. Sit down. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I should probably just go. But he's got a knife, and I don't want to make him mad. Ralph went to a lot of trouble to find something for the little girl to eat. I didn't feed her either, so it wouldn't be polite for her to refuse. It's okay, Wait. Alice. Oh, don't kill it in front of her. Okay, the, yeah, the good. Go over there. Go over there. That's good. Good. Yeah, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be fucking great. Okay. Succulent. You'll see. Succulent. Succulent. Where did you find that anyway? In like an urban town. Father, mother, little girl. Please, Car. I don't want to eat that. What did she say? I. I, 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 I want to be honest. She said she doesn't want to eat it. Oh, come on! Well, maybe it's not good enough. <laughs> maybe she's used to better things. But Ralph did this for her, so she's going to eat! Oh my god. Okay. All right. Okay, fine. Great. I just said I didn't want to piss the guy off with a knife, and then what did I do? Go ahead. Eat. Go on. Alice, it's, come on, it's, it's Bert, but it won't hurt you, it's just meat, come on, I know you're hungry. Hey! Oh my god. Oh my god. Eat. 
why don't I have another option? We're going to stand up now. And we're going to leave, Ralph. No. Oh no. Then you're not going to leave. Why not? Why don't you leave? Until Ralph says so. Let's do family! Okay. You wanted to be like a family, Ralph? Father, mother, the little girl, remember? I don't remember him saying that, but okay. Father would never threaten his little girl with a knife to make her eat. <sighs> Ralph went to a lot of trouble. I know. That's why. It's okay to he be mad. To eat. But Ralph is not bad. I mean, not bad. Sometimes your fear makes you do things you regret. I know. We've been through this. Anybody home? No! There's blue blood on the fence. No, there isn't! I know another android. Was when I scratched myself! Oh no! Uh-uh! No! No, I can't! I can't do this! Oh no! This is like Assassin's Creed Rogue all over again! Oh, Connor, why? Why can't you just let her go? Oh, Connor, no. Oh, no, I like you less now! Ah, oh, when I scratch myself! Oh, no! Oh, shit. Okay, well, I made him feel good, Ralph. I made Ralph feel good, right? I talked him down. I'm not being a thug. Maybe he likes me enough he's gonna protect me! Oh no, I don't know, I don't know. I'm his family. He'll do what's necessary to save me. Not going to the door. Not going to the door. We're gonna go around this way. <laughs> fucking hell. Oh, fucking hell! There is no trail, as far as I'm concerned. There is no trail! Stop it! I can't believe, also, that it's still raining. That's crazy. Well, I obviously didn't go back here, so I don't know why I'm going back here. I'm just stalling for time. I don't want to do it! No, I hate it when games make me do this! It's almost like it's asking me to pick favorites! Ah! Nope. 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 No one will look for us here, Kara said. <laughs> Oh, come on now. I did the thing. There you go. Oh, Ralph. Hi, Ralph. I will reassure him. Don't be afraid. I'm not gonna hurt you. Oh, boy. I'm not asking any of those questions. I don't want him to find her. No! Ah, oh, fuck! Blue blood? There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android. He's machine. doing. He's doing Ralph the corner thing. coming through. That's Ralph's blood. I'm sure there's a way he can tell that he's lying. I don't want to ask. I don't want to ask. He seems to be protecting her. <sighs> nope. Nope. Not doing it. Not doing it. I can't. I have. I have to buy car a time. Okay, he's got a bad eye. W R six hundred. Gardener. Oh, so I guess all custodial androids kind of maybe sort of look the same. But that's what he's supposed to look like. That's reported missing. Okay. Well, uh, found him. Cool. All right. Anything else? There you go. I was assuming we would have to scan this. Oh, it's a burn mark. I thought he was slashed with a knife. What happened? Irreversible skin damage. Extreme heat. Ugh. Man, that's worse than I thought it was. I can only scan his face. I've scanned his entire facial region. Unless this? No? So, wh where am I looking here? Oh, here we go. God, alright. It does leave a trace. 
Probability of self-destruction moderate. Oh, shit! Do I have to do it again? I don't want to do that again! <laughs> Fuck! Okay. Uh, I'm assuming that's supposed to be yellow, but I kind of did that at a weird time. But alright, yeah. Okay. So it doesn't leave a trace. It's just kind of blinking right now. And I caught it while it was off. Alright! Oh, no! I have to do it again?! His level of stress is up there, man. Okay, uh... Uh... That's not- It's red, though! It's not good! Ah, I'm gonna leave! Goodbye! <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> nope! Can I go into the back room, please? Oh my god, his level of stress is going all over the place. Can I look here? Three people. Food? Androids don't eat. Hmm. Great. Let me ask you a question. Are there any other androids here? Other androids? No. Ralph is alone. Oh my god, he's actually- he's covering for me. I wonder if I make him mad and don't get him to trust me enough, he won't cover for me and he'll give me up. There it is again. I need Connor to see this. This is what he needs to see. The RA9 thing isn't- is- is all over. I don't wanna ask him that! <laughs> Fucking hell! Alright, hey buddy. I'm looking for an AX400. Have you seen it? Ralph's seen nobody. Good boy, Ralph. Good boy. Oh, I'm so conflicted! I want Connor to do a good job and- 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 and improve his relationship with Hank. But I don't want him to catch Kara and Alice either. I don't even know why I don't- I mean, they'll deactivate Kara, right? She's a deviant. And I promised Alice we'd be together forever. Coming, Lieutenant! No, wait. His level of stress goes up when I go over to the stairs. Going up. Maybe I don't want to go up! <laughs> No, actually, I want to go up. I want to go up. I want to go up. I I want to I want to check out the body in the bathroom. Is anyone upstairs? No. Nobody. He's telling the truth. They left. They left. Oh god. Okay, thank god they left. No, I want to check out the body in the bathroom. I want to look at the body in the bathroom. Fucking hell. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Mr. Mr. Anderson! <laughs> Damn it. I can't let him out. Can I please go upstairs? Let me go up the- Connor. Connor. Our, our stairs too hard for you to operate! Get out of the stairs! Okay, hold on. What am I doing with my life right now? He said coming, Lieutenant. But I can't open the door. Excuse me, sir! I can't do... Anything. No, I looked at the table already. What about wire cutters? There they are. Yeah, I knew leaving those behind was a bad idea. Fuck. Okay, well... Find... Wait, what was that? Show it to me again. Find source of the stress. Oh, okay, I get it now. Game! Hey, Ralph, you wanna play a game? Oh, hi. Connor. What the fuck are you doing? My job? Did you find something? No. No, it's not here. Yeah, just like I said in the first place. Come on, let's get out of here. No! I'm still looking! Connor. He's acting weird. Alright, well I had one more thing to look at, but... Oh! I almost found them! Oh my god, thank you, Ralph. Thank Thanks. you. Protect the little girl. I will. The humans must not find her. Gotcha. Crystal clear. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Oh my god, that was so close. Could I have found them just then? Bye, Ralph. Go back to doing what you're doing, buddy. Oh my god, that dinner scene. 
That dinner scene, man, was so stressful. I thought he was gonna try and hurt us and I was actually gonna have to use the gun. I considered it too. I did. I was like, he's, he's yelling at her and he's mad. So like, run, Kara, run. Oh my god. God, when he screamed, it scared the crap out of me. Scared me so bad. Okay, but there's a couple of cross-chapter impacts here. And I'm betting these are depending on where you stay. Like, one for the motel, one for the parking lot, maybe. Um, yeah. So, uh, there's nothing up there, because I didn't stay there. Morning in the squat. I look at Ralph's stuff. I'm assuming that's stealing the money. I did not take the money. I already have money. I didn't need to take the money. So I left it. I read the leaflet. I checked on Alice. I read Cyber Wildlife and Canada. And I took the gun back. I still have the gun. I removed LED. I don't know what that is. But then I went downstairs. Police arrived. He wanted a family meal. I agreed to sit. I tried to convince Ralph and he apologized. <sighs> then we were disturbed by Connor. He kept quiet. See, I think he could have totally ratted me out. If I wasn't nice to him and acted like a total thug the whole time, I'm betting he would have ratted me out. I'm betting he would have. <sighs> I didn't do as bad on the previous car mission as I thought I did. Oh my god. They're undiscovered. I didn't find them. <sighs> I'm betting that's what that is up there too. You can totally find them. And I almost did. It gave me one more thing to look at, and it was either the boxes where they were hiding or the arcade game. And I was like, hey, Ralph, let's play a game. Oh, my God, I almost found them. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, dude. Oh, my God. There's a heck of a lot more. So if I find them, that's bad. And that leads to this whole other sequence of events. I don't know if it's bad, but it's probably bad, right? And that leads to this whole other sequence of events. Oh, did I do good? Tell me if I did good, because I don't know if I should be letting Connor find the evidence or not! Oh god! <laughs>